Welkom so met my chef Dino in die kombuis vandag. So, dis vrydag, iets die soot, iets die bieke Grieks, taking something traditional, make it a bit more Greek, maar, you know, soos baie dinge, but as baie vroeg ons begin in die ochend, wat gebeur as jy werk toe kom, en jy bring al jou bestandjelle, al jou dinge, maar in jou pan om iets te kook nie. So, my plan vir vandag, hoopelik werk het uit, is om my traditionele frying pan te gebruik, bykie gesmelte boter, meal, just covered it, we're gonna cook in here, hopefully it works out, let's see how it goes. So, wat gaan ons vandag maak? So, Griekse yoghurt, banana brood. So, die bestanddele, just to get that sweetness, okay, we got our traditional onto, met jou bananas wat jy gebruik, the more ripe, the better, so moet nie wanneer die ou bananas, haal het terug, mash it, jy weet die story. Dan, Griekse yoghurt, Apple sauce, wat ek gekryd, just to give it a bit more texture and sweetness. Suiker, geklitste eiers, meel, bieke baksode, sout, vanilla, and then for die losse stikkie, just a bit of chalk chips that we're going to mix into it. So, baie makkelike proces, soos jy weet, ons wil nie te veel moeite op vrijdag heen nie. Al ons banane in een, die yoghurt, just smash it out. Get it all out there. Een, Oh, apple sauce. You can see it's going to be one of those mornings, guys. So, jylle moet saam met my... Just give me patience. Want daar, jylle kan my volg op my webblad, www.thischefdino.co.za Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, The Chef Dino, alles is daar. Let's get that sugar. And the air. That's it, and now we're just going to mix it. So this, it doesn't look appetizing now, but don't worry, we'll get there. So van hier af, my oont is al klaar aan. 160 grade, that's all you want. Okay, baie belangrijk om te weet wanneer ek my meal inklits. We don't want to overwork it, you know, you don't want to get too much energy, because it's quite a nice dense, you want to get that perfect balance. Light, not too light, dense, not too dense. So, maak seker, is net, as al die meel dier geklits is, that's all you want. You don't want to work it further than that point. Dan is hy gereed, dan gaan ons in ons pan sit, in die oond, en ek denk, wanneer jy in die tweede segment terugkom, we're just going to go through the whole process again, check on it, make sure we're going to have a success story, and not a flop. So, laat ek gauw, hierdie, let's see if dit is, Okay, I'm just mix it. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna get it in slowly, slowly. So, gewoonlik, as ek die rechte pan gebring het, jylle, dit moet so vir so 20 minute, half uur bak in die wind. Maar, let's see, we're gonna have to go with the flow. So, terug na die spanboon, ek sê vir die tweede segment. Welkom terug in die kombuis, sam met my chef Dino. So, Our mission is looking good so far. I feel like you're a big come around. Okay, I just wanna take show you. What do you know? You can't bake in a frying pan, eh? But I think the most important thing is that that's the easy part. We must not stay at all. That can be challenge for us. So let us recap what we're going to do next. So in the beginning, I made bananas. I think it was three bananas. Nice, soft, it's got the bruising on, 100% sweetness, that's what you want. Mash, 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 mash. On the kant, some of that. But once you've got a bit of apple sauce, the Greek yogurt, if you're feeling a little bit, uh, although it doesn't really matter, you can go low fat, man, you may it. You've got sugar and all of that. Why do, why, why do you want to do that? If you're going to do this, do it right. It's a banana bread, you know, it's nostalgic. I add a bit of Greek into it. The sauce gives it the sweetness. A bit of suiker, vanilla, you can vanilla puyer, vanilla paste, vanilla essence. Then, just to give it that extra little bit of luxury, I put in those chocolate chips in the end. As you will, I know with a few words, you can put it in it as you will. So, let look, the recipe is easy. It's your case, you put in what you want. And that's the most important thing, when you mix all your wet ingredients first with the sugar, then, after the time, 